So now check how we write ng for loop um, to iterate elements and display on the UI. We use ng for and um, let's start with writing in Angular 16 version. Then we'll write it in Angular 17. So let's just push it up. Okay. Now in Angular 16 version, we used to stay the same ng for let fruit of fruits will add fruits on the other side so now we need some um, some list of values Let's just add only two fields right now and uh, to display it. This is how we display the value. Let's see. So now orange and banana displayed. Let me just set this also to be centered to view it. Orange and banana. Now you are seeing. Also, let me just change size to see it easily okay now you see orange and banana displayed this is the version 16 um, way of uh, implementing ng for now we'll change the same thing to version 17 so it will be like It is much more easy with version 17. So ng for the same thing name of fruits and we need to add a track track by name and within this as usual simply we need to display the same thing. Okay. Oh, sorry. Track by fruit. Okay. Now it will display. This is Angular 17 display. I'll just say 17. And if you want to center a line, again we need to use this div. Let's just use this div. Plain div will use just to align this content to center okay. now this thing these two values came from angular 17 version so this previously we, with version 16 we used to write ng for and uh, this is the list and we used to get each value out of it like this with angular version 17 we we write it like write the for loop like this at the rate for fruit of fruits and we track this particular list by one of the value which is fruit right now it is since it is not a object format let's change this one to object and see instead of plain values We'll change this to object like one comma so first value is orange so you can see id as one name as root name like this let's add one more record We'll say number two and it should be banana here. So let's see how we can set this. Now it won't work because it is object. Let's do this. Let's in Angular 16 right now we have a fruit 
it this one has id and name so id and uh, let's see what is what we used it is name only so let's say name this is how we display if you see we displayed this is version 16 and when it comes to version 17 root dot id we track it by id and uh, same thing we do in angular 17 if you see now this is the way to display in angular 17 so overall the display point of view everything is same just a minor change from ng for to at rate for and we give the same name and it is very minimal change it's not a completely big change when it comes to angular 17 for ng for loop